I'm on the southern edge of the Namib Desert. Here, plants can't get water not because it's frozen, but because rain hardly ever falls, only about one or two inches in the whole year. Most of the time, it's bone dry and devastatingly hot. Yet, almost unbelievably, there are trees standing out in the sands, totally unsheltered, with no sign of moisture anywhere around them. Water storage is the great trick here. These green, succulent leaves are full of it, and so are these bloated branches. The local bushmen used to cut off these branches and hollow out the spongy tissue and use them as containers for their arrows, which is why this tree is called the quiver tree. Its branches are covered with a blindingly white powder which reflects the heat, and its leaves have thick rinds with very few pores, which minimizes the amount of water they lose through evaporation. The trunk even of an old tree, ravaged by the years, remains smooth and impermeable. But even the quiver tree can't seal itself off totally from its surroundings. Living involves breathing, and some water vapour is inevitably lost in that process. But this tree has a way of reducing that. Self-amputation. It can cut off a leaf rosette and seal the stump. This branch will never grow leaves again, but with luck the tree will just survive with a reduced number of leaves and put out new shoots when conditions improve. 